to Malta. We've had a very, very early morning thus far. We started the day at 1 a.m. in the morning in London, arrived at the airport, bit manic, guys, bit manic. The UK situation right now is a bit wild, so I do suggest you get to the airport really early. Our check into our hotel, which we're currently in now, successfully, wasn't until 2 p.m. So we had some lunch at a cafe nearby called Eat Well, which was delicious. I had the hummus wrap, and then we chilled by the pool owned by a hotel, which was lovely also. The temperature outside, what are you saying, babe? Hot? Heat. Heat, guys, it's around 35. So since getting to our hotel and checking in, we've unpacked like you usually do, and we've gotten ready because we're gonna head out once again to actually explore the town of Giza? Gezira. Gezira, I believe. That's the town we're staying in. We're in Malta for two weeks. We're gonna be exploring the whole of Malta. I'm gonna vlog one week and then do separate videos in the second week we're here. Let's get the day started. It's currently 3 p.m. and the vlog shall commence from here. By the way, guys, when I mean unpack, I mean unload my Biscoff stash. So fit for half this day is this like white short combo with this white crop top, but it's all at the back really, guys. The detail is at the back and I love it. Like you say, we are gonna explore Gazira now get some bits from the supermarket and then get ready for this evening. He's putting in all the work. A little while later and it's the evening. We're dressed up in our evening outfits and we're about to go out for some much needed dinner. Our first eve, I will show you our outfits. Oh, she is a number! We are secretly matching. <laughs> Not on purpose, of course. Aww. Guys, the struggle is real when we have no photographer. We've got self timer instead. We have chosen to eat at Ponto tonight and it's got a mixture and an array of food, vegan and non-vegan, like us both. I've actually gone for sushi, so one of my favorites. What we were most attracted to about this restaurant in particular is the view. It is stunning, guys. Absolutely stunning. It is Sunday, and we are currently on a ferry. A ferry that takes us from Salima to Valletta, which is the main city in Malta. So exploring Valletta, get some lunch, enjoying the town, and see what's there. We are currently in Valletta. We're just walking to the city centre, but we are finding the buildings overly cute. I'm just loving how cute it looks. Of course you'd do that. So we stopped off for lunch and we've come to a place called Soul Green. I've gone with the tofu Buddha bowl and my Italian boyfriend has gone for the pasta, just like yesterday. <laughs> Some chippies. Just a little bit glammed up from when I last left you. We continue to explore the town of Valletta, which was very pretty. Would you say it's very pretty? Yeah. We are ready for dinner. Dinner number two and another fabulous evening. Right guys, we've ordered pizzas today. Um, this pizza is quite questionable. There's no tomato puree. I don't know why. I ordered the vegan pizza and it's just got loads of vegetables on there. Even a carrot and some broccoli, which I actually took off because it was very random and I ate it. Um, but yeah, I mean it will do, but it was just a bit weird. Essentially, some bread and some vegetables. We've come abroad yeah. to watch Love Island because <laughs> we love this show too much. So we are gonna end the eve here and we'll catch you for a fun-filled day tomorrow. And we're off. Another day, another boat ride. This morning we actually found a gym called Fort Fitness. We went to the gym, had our breakfast, and now we're on this boat. It's like an excursion. So we're going to Camino and Gozo, which are the, like the two islands that are essentially Malta as well. Um, so they'll take us around, we'll get to swim in the ocean, and it'll be a lot of fun. Bye, 
filming. Um, so we can't quite see the fishes. And you can see like on top of the water as well, so it is quite cool. It's hypnotizing. It is it's relaxing. I find it very relaxing. Look at the water! We're actually driving really, really fast. arrived at Crystal Bay and um, we're just going to jump off the boat now. There is a slide attached to this boat which is super fun. I'm about to go on the slide guys. I'm going to scream. I'm going to scream. So it's actually really busy. <laughs> we'll yeah. turn the other one. It's so busy. Look at all that. There's so many people here. Um, and that's only just one section of this like place. We've got another like hour or so. We're probably gonna do some tanning. We're actually gonna have a chilled evening today. And yeah. dinner spot this evening we thought we'd go for a chilled eve because we had quite a high impact day so we've come to a place called balance bowl which was highly suggested by many of you guys and they've got board games which i love that and so does manu because he loves beating me at every game that there ever is Two to win, three. Oh! <laughs> champion! I won snakes and ladders because I'm champion. So now we're playing a X rated guess who? Guess who? <laughs> guess who's naked? That's so funny. <laughs> Finally, the food has arrived. I've gone for the crispy soya chunks with for some bread and some dip. Um, my babs has gone for some chips, a vegan burger and an extra sausage on top. Very fitting with the game that we just played. Good morning, or should I say good afternoon actually. Um, we've had a slow morning, as usual we went to the gym because we love it. And now we are at Popeye Beach, which... Popeye the sailor man! <laughs> My taxi man has driven us here. We've hired a car for three days, guys. Madame, please. <laughs> 50 euro. <laughs> and he's done really well on the road. Actually, in Malta, you drive on the same... Same side. Same side <laughs> as England. So I've seen pictures of this Popeye place and obviously it is a bit of a tourist attraction. I think you've got to pay entry and stuff to get in, but it's worth a visit, I reckon. So we're just having lunch because we're a bit peckish. Did any of you guys watch Popeye when you were younger? I've only watched the cartoon version. I've never actually watched the real life version. So this is nostalgic in a sense, but apparently Popeye was filmed here. corner to see this are you kidding me i don't trust the look of her hands <laughs> beach time we are at golden bay it's actually not as busy as the blue lagoon yesterday which is nice we are gonna have a dip in the pool 
probably not gonna film as much today because it is just like a beach tan and chill kind of day and we'll probably catch you this evening. We are all dressed up for this evening. This is what I'm wearing. We have got this silky number on today. I feel like a mermaid in it. We've got some white sandals and this white top from Zara. The skirt is actually from Pull and Bear. And these sparkly, sparkly earrings. Not quite sure on the restaurant we want to go to yet, but we'll have a little bit of a search and decide where we want to eat and eat some good food. We're out for dinner and you guys suggested to come to this place called Hammett. The food has arrived. I've gone for the KFC cauliflower. We've then got some mushroom gyozas in here which look incredible, oh my goodness. And then we've gone for the aubergine katsu as well. Also very delicious. My bubbles has gone for some rice and chicken. I'm not even joking, this is the best gyoza that I've ever ever had. It's like cooked to perfection. So thank you to everyone that suggested it because this is incredible. Mm. How was your ice cream? They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. But you just can't get into it because they would never understand. It melted everywhere. Everywhere. I went for dark chocolate, orange, and strawberry. I went with lotus biscuit and coconut. And I was very jealous. And it was nice. It's Wednesday, and we're having a bit of a competition who can tan the most. It's obviously me. <laughs> I've just made that on the spot now. But we are at the beach again. We're having another beach day. This is called Paradise Beach, Paradise Bay. Paradise Bay. Yeah. So it's like another drive away from the beach that we went to yesterday, but yeah, thought we'd have like a double beach day just to chill and things and then we'll switch up from tomorrow. 1001 Instagram pictures later and we're having a little snack. I got some chips. They have these Kimmel chips, which I love at home, so I grabbed them. We're going to go in the water again to play his game. I'll bring my GoPro this time, but the water is definitely a lot clearer than yesterday and I really love it because it matches my bikini. tofu on the menu it's a random leaf there um, which I'm super excited about because I've been missing like protein being protein so this is like one of the first times I've, I'm having it definitely gonna have an ice lolly after this I am melting away honestly melting and we're back in the car well almost we are going home now after a crazy hot beach day ah! <laughs> and we're gonna get dressed up that was a big whip you Gonna get dressed up um, to a South African restaurant actually, which shall be nice. It's the same like chain group that we went to yesterday, Hammett's. Apparently, the guy explained that they have many like different restaurants, so we thought it'd be nice to try a different one tonight. and we have explored St. Julian's Bay and we've come to our dinner spot today which I said we are exploring the other hamlets except I did say it was South African it's actually Latin American which is incredible because I love like that kind of Mexican food it's Latin American is that Mexican? <laughs> anyways I love that kind of food we get the gist straight away I've seen guacamole with some like corn tostadas and then I'm also going to go for the chancho en piedra I definitely butchered that but it sounds delicious food has arrived I've gone for the guacamole like I said and like the salsa and then I also ordered myself some cassava fries because I just didn't think that was enough and I fancied some cassava which I love
Okay, chicas and chicos. This is the outfit that we wore tonight. Showcasing it very well. I'm wearing this Zara number. Absolutely love it. And we're ready to watch Love Island. Thank you. We've got a Layla and we've got a Bob. Bruh. Yeah, no, that, that's Bob. He's, he's called himself Bob and I could not stop laughing when the lady was like, how do you spell that? Be okay. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. They always get my name wrong, so I always make it up. <laughs> I'm Bob today. <laughs> Anyways, it is Thursday and we're actually going to a water park today. We've had our breakfast. We didn't go to the gym today because it was like a rest day for us. Um, but I fancied a nice coffee, so we came to Starbucks. After this, we'll head back, get changed, and get rolling with the day. We've arrived. So we are in the water park. It's called Splash and Fun. I love myself a water park. Well, both of us do. And we have come to the Lazy River first because you gotta start with the lazy. Yeah, you gotta start with the lazy one first, and then we'll go on some slides and work our way around. But this is so nice and relaxing. <laughs> So we're taking on the black hole. I'm just sitting down on the boat with my boyfriend. Three, two, one, go. Okay, so we're taking a pit stop. I've got some chips and bruschetta. How are we finding the ride so far? They were good. The orange one was steeper than I thought. Yeah. Oh my god, it was so much steeper than I thought. I was just laughing because we looked back at the GoPro footage and he barely has any reaction, guys. <laughs> Insert replay. <laughs> Anyways, we are going to have our lunch and then just carry on with the rest of the wall park. So we are off to St. Julian's Bay again. It's the last day of having the car as we rented it for three days So we thought we'd make use out of it and the petrol here is quite it's quite decent And we've got half a tank left which we received the car with no petrol So we thought let's drive to St. Julian's Bay today and make use of the car We figured we might go to this restaurant called Nar, but we'll see where it's located and what's it all about because it seems and sounds and looks nice so yeah we'll just see when we get there and hopefully have some delicious food by the way i'm wearing this green zara number zara doing it all over again it's a bit shorter than the other dresses that i've been wearing on this holiday but it's very cute and it's also very hot outside so it's perfect 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 We made it to Nar and we got our food. I got the vegan tofu pasta. He's got his steak, but look how amazing this looks. didn't melt as much as it did on that day because that was so traumatic we have finished up from our meal we fancied some gelato I've gone for the dark chocolate and pistachio with a view may I add and, a, and, and another view <laughs> so delicious a perfect way to end the day Friday today and we've come to our hotel's Lido I've got myself a soya Frappe. We are just gonna have a really chill day this morning and afternoon and then in the evening our plans are to go to um, the point which is the shopping mall and we love a good shopping mall when we're on holiday so we'd explore that together. I'm gonna be editing this vlog because it goes live tomorrow and just relax. Okay so 
just having lunch. I've gone for the orange and mango salad. I thought it was a bit different. It's actually really random. It has mango, orange, walnuts, tomato, quinoa, olive. I don't know what they call it, but it's just a concoction of good stuff that I'm craving. Hello, it's a little while later now and we're at the place called The Point. We've come here just to look around and we'll probably have dinner around where we live in Gazira. Um, but he fancies a Costa Frappuccino, is that what it is? Frappe? I think. I think it's like... A, I remember having Sunny and it was nice. Out of all the options here, he's stuck with the English Costa. Frappe acquired. We're in Bershka. There is a sale. I don't think I'm actually going to get anything. I'm just going to have a little bit of a browse. But this is my outfit for this evening. I am a bit hot outside, but it's perfect in this air conditioning, so it's okay actually. Actually, we've ended the day with the first restaurant that we came, which is quite cute because we love the view and we were undecided on what to eat. This restaurant has a variety, so we've gone for this. I'm getting the same old sushi with some roast potatoes, which is really random, but that's what I fancy. What has been your favourite day this week? I think the Blue Lagoon. Yeah, trip. yeah, that was same for me. Same for me. Hmm. Food has arrived. I've got my little sushi platter here. It looks fabulous. I've also ordered the side of roast potatoes. We're just gonna share those. But dinner with a view or once again. So guys, we are back in the room. I'm not naked. He's not naked yet. Bruh. We've been to the supermarket and he found fake Biscoff biscuits. So we are gonna end this video. We're gonna be trying poppies. Poppies. I have a lot of like Maltese followers because so many of you guys have been messaging me lovely suggestions from food places to places to visit so thank you so much to everyone that has suggested anything. More suggestions are welcome to us. We are staying here for another week. If these Biscoff biscuits are good, I'll stay here for life. I'm joking. It's a big statement. <laughs> okay, so here it is. I, I also want to make a statement that my Biscoff biscuits have now finished. I've finished them within the week. I've only got a little bit of Biscoff spread, so I am going to die. Our, I brought the Biscoff biscuits. Oh, actually, we both did. Mm, yeah. These are nice. They're just smaller. They're nice. They, ju they, they, they don't have the full whack of flavour, but they're delicious. I am going to end the vlog here, guys. Thank you so much for watching give us a big thumbs up subscribe to my channel flexi and more from me there'll be two more maltese videos to follow starting from tomorrow i'm filming a what i well what we eat in a day i haven't really been filming what i've been eating throughout the week it's just been like a mishmash of random lunches and dinners but tomorrow i will film like the whole day to give you a sort of an idea of what i typically eat on a holiday Bye. peace out yeah, my biscuits. Roll the bloopers. Pancakes with Leila.